Uh, ladies and gentlemen, we are with renowned uh, forensic investigator, uh, barrister, Tumfon barrister, Calvin Dango, who, as you know, is uh, a popular barrister in the Republic and legal advisor uh, to the National Chairman of the Social Democratic Front, a philanthropist, and a man of the moment uh, based on his innovative ideas. Tumfo Barrister Calvin Dango, you've made a statement this week that has gone viral in the social media and it's been reported all over the media about uh, the importance of the clergy getting involved to encourage civilians or citizens get registered in the voters list. Can you kindly introduce yourself once more and expand shade on this innovative idea? Thank you very much, Mr. Bo. Um, Tumfo Barista Ndango Ta Calvin, a lawyer by profession, a forensic investigator, criminal expert, and politician. Uh, I happen to be the legal advisor of the Social Democratic from the SDF. And uh, in the, uh, at the eve of uh, very crucial elections in our country, uh, I decided to send a clarion call to the clergy and to the imams to do everything in their powers to make sure that uh, their faithfuls are registered on the voters' register. I think it is very crucial because if Cameroon is good tomorrow, Cameroon is good to all of us. Cameroon will not only be good, to some people and some people should not sit behind and wait for others to do things for them. We must all in our own efforts help to make sure that we have a better country tomorrow. I think you see, it, is a, it is a human right. We are not saying that uh, people should register and vote a particular party. We are encouraging every Cameroonian to register. When the time to choose a party will reach, we will see call on them to choose wisely. For now, our call is for Cameroonians of all walks of life to register on the voters' list and register massively. Special call to the youths of this country that don't be deceived by the people, the old people that are in power, that the youths are leaders of tomorrow. Youths are not leaders of tomorrow. Youths are leaders of today. Even the Bible says, serve the Lord in the days of your youth. So you are not going to save your country only when you are old. We should learn to distinguish political slogans like save the that tomorrow is. I saw a communique, I saw a very old minister, a political bureau member, saying that uh, tomorrow is going to be your turn. No, tomorrow is not your turn, it is today. And that's why I'm encouraging the youth, don't only register, take very active part in any political party of your choice and militate and take power at that level. Don't wait for power to be given to you. If you wait, the power will never come. And we cannot, we cannot afford to sit and complain backstage. Nobody should discourage you. Some people have been disappointed to what happened to the SDF or to the late national chairman of the SDF in the 90s. And they take that one to discourage youths that uh, even if you vote, it will not, uh, nothing will change. We are telling you that if the youths vote massively, there will be a change. 1990 is not 2024 or 2025. Things are gradually changing in this country. And let all of us be part of the change that is coming to Cameroon. Now, based on the uh, remarks that you made, the declaration that you made, uh, which went viral, why did you, what prompted you to focus on the church and uh, the imams, the clergy and the imams. Uh, do you have the impression that probably in the past people have been focusing mostly on prayer mm. without being conscious that uh, while praying, people should also get into action? Is that what prompted you? What prompted me is the fact that people make prayers and think that uh, uh, our God is going to do magic. Our God walked through us. The God that we pray for works through people. And you cannot fold your hands and continue praying that you want things to work. If you fold your hands and you are not working, you will die of hunger. So if you fold your hands and you keep on praying that Cameroon to change without taking active part, without taking part actively to make sure that Cameroon changes, Cameroon will remain the same. 
So we, uh, that's why I call on the clergy to go on a political evangelism to make sure that they encourage citizens to be good citizens, to encourage our faithfuls to be good citizens and participate actively in the, in the political life of the country. We are not saying that the priests should choose a political party for their, for their faithfuls. We are always saying that encourage our faithfuls to register and take active part in the political life of the country. Prayers, yes, but prayers without action, no. Nobody can succeed only with prayers. You must pray and you must take active, active part to make sure that God helps you are, God helps the works of your hands. Tumfam, before we part company, are you surprised with the feedback so far? You just made a statement from your heart and I mean you were in the you, you, you made you made the cover page of uh, you made the cover page of at least ten newspapers carried by almost all blogs. Journalists are calling all over. Are you surprised by this feedback? I was really taken aback. I was really surprised because I was not uh, expecting that the, uh, the the press is going to give so much importance to to what I said. But I'm very happy that it happened that way. I was even surprised that I was uh, elected uh, man of the week by readers of the Guardian Post newspaper, and uh, so I received so many calls, and uh, particularly from. Uh, 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 Tumfo Barista Nico Halle who called to appreciate me and congratulate me for what I'm doing to make sure that uh, things change in our country and taking very independent stands at times not polit not uh, partisan but general for the general good of the country. So I was really surprised and I want to take this opportunity to thank the press for giving such importance to words that are coming from my humble self. Uh, country people them, we therefore hear so with Tumfon. Tumfon, barista attack having done what we know, saying a popular uh, barista and solicitor for your own year, when a man we know big book, he don't study big book suite, we, for that way they require us to say law. Now, legal advisor for chairman for Social Democratic Front, where as we know, if you don't be legal advisor for Papa Power, he be die so. We therefore hear because what I make it tell you what he gave for talk. Concerning the fact that many people then go register their name for vote for the election within the council. As a law, Papa. Thank you very much, uh, Mr. Bo. I'm uh, glad plenty have when I come listening this small story. Last week, I'll be sent some small story for us. I went newspaper and carry on plenty. Where I talk, say, people forgot when I passed to them and imam them, father them, made them do all things for make, say, make people register for electoral register. The work, the thing we will make Cameroon change, there will be only prayer. The thing we will make Cameroon change, now prayer, where it work out with action, where we will take and fulfill. Now, what are they encourage all man, say, as you pray, say, make Cameroon change. Also, take action for make sure so you register for say, may God bless the works of your hands. Not just should not the prayer, say, may anything change. If you be a businessman, you should not fill your house and make prayer. Say, me money enter your pocket. No money no go enter your pocket. Now, when you take action for work some small thing, God bless the small work where you work. Now, he will money go enter your pocket. This time around, now for choose who they will run with country. We must do everything for make sure, say, we'll ride with name. So that when that time reach, we'll participate for choose who will run with country for make say, meeting them better for the country. Make man no fool now. As I say, you vote not to change something. If we register, we plenty, things they will change. Make some old people not tell you when I say, they will register so for 1990 and 92, what it happen. Tell them say, today no be 1990, today no be 1992. Me no man no fool when I say, use them as leaders of tomorrow. Use them as leaders of today. As I detail when I saw, because when they detail, we will not say, you then are leaders of tomorrow. Before that, tomorrow, one race you don't owe. They will tell when I say, you then are see leaders of tomorrow. You then will take the power for their hand and make sure say, they encourage all men. Make it put hand for make sure say, more will vote and protect will vote. Never only for go vote. Now for vote, protect them and make sure say, your vote count. You must stand there and make sure say, they count your vote and tell you the result. Now why the was they send this small story for all man, for church, for all imams them 
for everybody make them make sure say make them to make all man register if we day make they open some particular day some special day for their churches where they will bring a lecam me a lecam register people the way the one would me no man no frightening wuna. some people don't decide otherwise say me no they don't want uh, election so one the check say no they will want change government for their own way if you want to change government for your own way, no disturb me, 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 me to not change for my own way because you know even be sure so that your own way we want change and they will work. We don't decide say we want change and that will ballot box and we they we will feel do up for change up with ballot box. We want that same thing they change for Cameroon, make peace day. All we like now peace, nothing fine no will come when uh, trouble day. If we start make trouble, no man no will even vote again. But we make sure say make all man register and make all man vote. Leave we where we want vote, may we vote. People do what they want, take their different road, may they take them. We will see who will first reach. Uh, nous sommes des Africains, tout le monde. Mm -hmm. On sait que uh, vous êtes uh, uh, un avocat international, vous êtes uh, un expert en criminologie, vous êtes uh, le conseiller légal du plus uh, de, 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 du parti de l'opposition historique du Cameroun, qui est le sujet démocratique front. Ça fait quelques jours, un tout fond. Barista Tark a fait une sortie médiatique où vous avez encouragé les Camerounais, encouragé surtout la, la, la clergé, c'est parce que tu as le clergé, on avait comme le clergé et les imams de se mobiliser pour encourager les Camerounais à s'enregistrer sur les listes électorales. Cette, cette déclaration a été bien reçu par la presse, a été bien reçu par la population. Est-ce que vous pouvez vous présenter au Camerounais et nous expliquer pourquoi vous avez donné ces suggestions-là Merci beaucoup, M. Bo. Je suis uh, Tumfo Barestan Dangota, car un avocat avec résidence professionnelle à Yaoundé. Je suis un expert en contentieux administratif, expert en investigation criminelle, euh, avec résidence à Yaoundé. Euh, la semaine passée, j'ai lancé un appel aux hommes de Dieu et aux imams de faire en sorte que le, les chrétiens, surtout les chrétiens, et soient inscrits sur le liste électoral. C'est important parce qu'on ne doit pas passer notre temps à prier sans prendre une action vers la bonne direction. Prier seulement ne va pas, nous, ne va pas faire grand-chose. Dieu bénit les œuvres de nos mains. Dieu bénit nos actions. On ne peut pas prier seulement pour que les choses changent dans, dans ce pays. J'ai donc encouragé les hommes de Dieu de faire en sorte d'ouvrir, de, de, de même de créer un jour, un jour dans leurs églises, dans leurs paroisses, pour que les chrétiens soient inscrits sur les listes électorales. Je lance un appel particulier aux jeunes de s'inscrire. Et les vieux qui sont au pouvoir, qui pensent que les jeunes sont de l'idée de demain, sont en train de nous tromper. Et le temps est en train de passer. Les jeunes sont de l'idée d'aujourd'hui, pas de demain. Même la Bible dit, il faut servir Dieu quand tu es encore jeune. On doit servir notre pays aussi quand nous sommes jeunes. C'est pour ça que nous, on encourage les jeunes de tout faire pour s'inscrire. Je ne suis pas en train de choisir un parti politique. Je suis militant d'un parti politique. Mais pour le moment, j'encourage tout le monde de s'inscrire et participer activement pour le changement de, de notre pays. En 2025, ou à tout moment, où les, quand les élections seront lancées dans notre pays. Donc, euh, je prends cette occasion aussi pour encourager et éduquer ceux qui sont en train de s'inscrire. Il faut bien t'inscrire. Il y a les gens qui, qui passent ici dehors, tout part. Il y a les gens qui sont venus d'Indiane, spécifiquement. Je parle d'Indiane parce que euh, j'ai un chauffeur qui a amené les gens de soir ici à Yaoundé. Et ils étaient à la Mélin pour faire l'inscrire les sortissants d'Indiane et pour qu'ils euh, ne pas voter en Indiane le moment venu. Et même s'ils ne parlent pas, les gens vont voter pour eux. Il faut s'assurer que quand tu t'inscris, on te donne un reçu. Il faut t'assurer que là où tu t'inscris, 
c'est là où tu vas voter. Ne te fais pas, ne t'inscris pas pour que les autres vont voter pour toi. Parce que c'est ce qui s'est passé ici à Yaoundé. J'entends aussi des nouvelles de d'autres régions que euh, on fait des inscriptions dans des maisons privées des gens. On doit tout faire pour bloquer tout cela, tout ce qui n'est pas légal. Donc c'est à nous de s'inscrire et voter et protéger nos voix. On ne peut pas jeter de voix et on rentre chez nous. Dès que tu votes, tu restes là pour t'assurer que tes voix comptent pour le changement de notre pays.